Hello ladies and gentlemen, yes, Zeke here again today to bring you a guide on remapping controls in Star Citizen, early versions. So in your data folder, first things first, you're going to want to create a file called controls and then a file in there called mappings. This is where your Star Citizen game will pull from if you try to pull custom mappings. So next thing you're going to want is an XML file. Usually you can save a notepad file as .xml and it will just automatically convert. I was having trouble with that so I found one and edited it in Notepad+. Plus. You can see my final version just over here. Next thing you're going to want to do is go to Stanton Space Barn and this is a tool that somebody that Stanton, I don't know exactly who it is, has um, created to help people edit XML files. So what you're going to want to do is go to Action Map, and let's say you want to switch around the pitch and yaw, or the, yeah, the roll and yaw, which is a very common complaint right now. You'd want to go to yaw down here, and choose the device, just a regular joystick, and change it to axis Z, or sorry, Y in my case. So that would make it so that if I tilt the joystick left and right, it would actually yaw to either side. Now, you also are going to want to add the opposite binding, so you're going to want to change the roll to the axis Z, which is, of course, the rotation of the joystick for me, and add that. Now, you can add new controls in entirely here, but you have to click this map joystick as keyboard, and that will take up the entire button for a single purpose. So if you wanted to, let's say, add... Um, well, let's let's go for a combat or a a weapons. So let's say you wanted to nope, not that either. Hmm. HUD. Let's say you wanted to add a button to open tab number three, which I think is the weapons tab in the HUD. You'd have to press the map joystick as keyboard and then choose a button. If you want to figure out what all your buttons are on your joypad, all you have to do is go to control panel or devices and printers right there there we go that'll open up click on whatever your joystick is properties I did that wrong game controller settings advanced nope properties I always get that wrong and then you can play around with your buttons and as you can see they light up as you press them and you can see what number they all are so another quick and dirty so after you've created all of these mappings and you've copied them into an XML file and saved them, so you can edit this just in Notepad, and saved it to the folder that I got you to make earlier, the mappings folder, you can very easily activate this by going into Star Citizen, which I will open up in front of everything right now. Oh, no I did not. Which I will now open up in front of everything. and type and press the tilde key. Tilde key is of course the key right next to one. Then you're going to want to type pp underscore rebind keys which should not all be in caps but I don't think it matters custom or whatever you named the XML folder and as you can see it loaded. If you want to go back to the original all you have to do is type it all again pp underscore rebind keys and just press enter and it will go to factory default. Okay, so that's method one. If you want a more quick and dirty way of assigning some of the keyboard buttons to your controller, you will still need you'll still need your control panel open, devices and printers, game controller settings and properties. And you will also want the program Joy to Key, which is a free program you can get online. It's super convenient and very easy to use. I'm trying to open it up right now, but it doesn't seem to want to. And as you can see, I have button 30 on my controller already mapped to the cap lock key. So you can just quickly do that. All you have to do is go joystick one. It will automatically go to the first joystick you have assigned. Double click on one of the things you want assigned and then press the keyboard key that you want in that area. Now, I don't want to assign anything, so that is Joy to Key. I will also leave a link to that in the description. I hope this helps anybody out who wanted to remap controls. 
Um, if you have any questions, please post them in comments. And if you enjoyed the video, please do leave a like. I, I like seeing those likes there. Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.